Hey, what's up guys and welcome back to Ask NK. Today we're taking a look at an amazing add-on that you can have in Blender. And this add-on is known as the Interior Essential Asset Library, which is made possible by the guys at Digital Architecture. Now, this plugin comes with over 360 because you know they kind of updated it recently so it comes with over 360 plus assets that you can get and over 50 different pbr materials that you can actually work with now if you want to work on some interiors you're an, an architect you're actually trying to get some you know some assets that you can use for your scene maybe you're doing some animations and stuff then this is definitely going to come in extremely handy now there are some good news for this particular video which we're making and and it is that these guys don't only exist on the blender market which is apparently where you can buy your stuff but of course they also have a website where you can get a free version and play with it so if you want to get the free version you want to play with it you can actually come and get the free version with the limited assets but then you also be able to have some materials that you can also play with you can also go through and check the documentation and of course you can take a look at some of the assets that you can get here very premium looking materials that you can use and these materials are both supported for you know ev and also cycles if you take a look at some of the assets right here you can see they are already production ready and i don't think you would want to tweak this thing for anything in the world except you just want to throw them into your scene and start rendering and without further ado let's take a look at blender and see how this works so by default for you to get things going of course you need to go over to edit go over to preference do all of that installation of add-on stuff and once once you have that done the next thing which you need to do is press n on your keyboard and right here you would notice we have the interior essentials now with the interior essential panel open there are a whole lot of things that you can do first off let's get rid of the cube and click right here and we will be able to take a look at some of the things that we have right here so i've actually gone ahead to get the final version or the full version of this and you can see that we can check through to see some of the bathroom stuff that they have here we can see some ceramic stuff that they have here and if you're looking for all of the furniture within the category and you want to see all of them you can simply click right here and you will be able to see you know the furniture you can also check out for the kitchen so that you can see some stuff and you can also see some pillows depending on what you're looking for actually and if you're looking for some fruits you can actually come through and check these things out once you have anyone that you want just simply click on ok and that will be right there press the period key and zoom right in and if you check out this within Eevee it's gonna load up the materials and you can see that this looks pretty pretty nice of course if you want to also see this with cycles all you need to do is just simply switch cycle on and you will be able to see it now there is a second you know good news that i have that comes with this particular video now the good news that i have is i did speak with the developer and it turns out that there's a coupon code for anyone who wants to actually get this but before we talk about that coupon code let's see what the materials look like so if you're trying to get stuff like this you can see what it looks like in the cycles really cool and of course you can choose to do whatever you want to do with that so let's go through and select this but before we delete this if you want to tweak this to your liking you need to click on the make instance editable and once you do that you will be able to select these things and you can see right here you can you know go into the edit menu and and make some tweaks to this if this is actually what you want so with this out of the way let's jump right back and take a look at something else and we're looking at materials now what i'm going to do next is just simply create a plane and maybe a simple cube now i'm beginning to wonder why we took out the default cube in the first place so let's create that simple cube and position this cube right here if you want to apply materials or you want to play with the pbr all you need to do is select a surface or a mesh click right here where you have the add materials find the material that you want maybe we can go with something and by the way you can click all the way down here to preview or review more so i'm just going to go through and click on plywood and click on ok and right here you have that i will switch over to the shading so that we can see what we have and if i simply select this right here i can also go through and make some selection of materials over here now there are some interesting things that i would like to share with you guys before we actually move on now one of the interesting things right here is you can apply this material and it actually sticks with whatever you're doing so in case you're modeling and you're wondering if this is going to stick to it yes it does it will and of course we're going to try that so if i have this cube selected and press the tab key and switch over to face click right here press i on the keyboard to insert i can insert this and you can notice that it finds a way to kind of conform to the surface if i press e 
key on the keyboard I can extrude that and you can also see that let's press you know control B just to bevel this and you can see it. so you can see it doesn't look bad at all press tab to jump all the way out let's preview this and this looks pretty nice so for the materials if you're wondering yes you can select these materials if you want to tweak these materials yes of course you can switch over to the shader section right here and you can tweak this to your heart content so depending on what you want to do you can definitely find you know satisfaction playing with these things and getting good with them so right here you can see that we have a truckload of materials that you can use so if you're feeling happy and you're looking for premium materials of course this add-on gets you covered and one more thing to keep in mind is if you want to add some you know some objects into your scene there is a whole lot of objects so from furniture like we've looked at you can see this right here you can also find some other cool stuff that you want now this is very interesting because these assets all come with full materials now they don't just come with full materials but they are made in you know ways that you're going to like them since they finessed and actually modified these things to look very very production ready so in less than few seconds you can just go through set up your scene get some pretty cool things happening for you and if you want to try out this tool you can check out the free demo and the free demo comes with a couple of things that you might want to try out so these are the things right here if you're an architect if you are a scene developer if you're into interior rendering if at all you're into animation and of course you're looking for something that can ease the burden of stuff that you're working on then you should definitely give this one a try i mean you can see that the lamp itself has some lights pumping all the way out let's switch this over to ev and see what we have so this is more like you know shedding a lot of weight from you so if there are things that you're looking forward to you can definitely get these things out of the way so something else to also keep in mind is if you want to get this tool so let's switch over so if you want to get this you can definitely come over to the link in the description because there is a coupon code that is down there which i have spoken with the developer and he is giving 15 percent off for anyone who wants to get this so right here if you want to get this particular tool you can definitely come through and you can see that there are three different versions of this tool which one of them is the essential one for interior the essential tool that comes with the plant and pots and then the final one which is both the plants the pots and also the full objects that you want so if you want to get any of this you can simply take a look in the description there is a particular link that you can take through and of course you would be able to apply the 15 percent discount and get a 15 percent off if you you know you want to get some realistic rendering stuff and you want to build these things in less than a minute i mean this tool is something that you should actually consider so tell me what you you guys think about this in the comment section and of course if you want to try out the free one the free one is also here so you can try it out so tell me what you guys think about this in the comment section and of course if you like this video or you learned something from this you can go ahead and give it a like and don't forget to share with a friend and if you're new here it's going to be amazing for you to hit the subscribe button and also turn on notifications so that you don't miss the next video or the next update and until i see you guys again with a tutorial update free friday tutorial tuesday tips and tricks things like this peace